Hello, everybody. We're going to take a journey to the Ziggurat. So, this game, if you're not familiar with it, which most people are not, uh, it's, just, it's kind of a hack and slash game. You go into each room, and you have to defeat the enemies. There's not too much really involved with it, it's just um, mostly you just skill with uh, how fast you are, how accurate you are at shooting. Uh, but the game is just really fun because um, number one, it's a, it's a roguelite. So every playthrough is a little bit different. Um, you can get different weapons in this uh, scenario. I have two weapons. Um, every time you start the game, you might get uh, different weapons. Um, you, can, you can pick different characters, which have different negatives and pros and all that. Um, so, yeah, I just thought I'd show you this game. Uh, it's kind of one of those hidden gems, and uh, here we go. So when you get enough ex experience points, as you can see, you get to uh, pick some perks. Um, and uh, with this character, you get to pick from one of two perks. Um, so sometimes they're they're kind of uh, kind of negative. In this case, you know, you can increase your health but reduce the size of your mana pools. Well, how much does it reduce? That's the main question. It doesn't tell you. Um, this one says increase your alchemy mana pool. So I think I'm going to pick this one um, just because, you know, it's it's the safe choice. Um, and uh, But yeah, each, each weapon gets a separate, um, you know, uh, level of... of fuel, so to speak. It's called mana. So, you got your wand. That regenerates. You got, well, you, we don't have it right here, but there's a spell book. That's number two. Number three is um, your staff. And that's green mana. And uh, your alchemy uh, is, is kind of this orange uh, color. So, so you have to manage that. Um, you can get more mana by killing enemies and picking up uh, mana uh, crystals. Um, so that's the good news. Uh, the bad news is a lot of these enemies are very tough. And oh god, no. Oh boy. So. It also helps to know which enemies you need to kill right away in this game. Um, that that enemy I just killed back there, the tall one, I believe that's called a Lich. Uh, but that character can create uh, more skeletons and enemies, and um, their attack can do massive damage. So that's why I like to just kill that thing as fast as possible. Um, so as you can see, my staff is pretty nice. shoots pretty quickly. It bounces off the walls, etc. Um, I think I'll just play this level and uh, just show you how, kind of how it works. At the end of the level, well, first of all, there's a key. We've got the portal key. Okay, so um, you got to find the portal key, which we have, and then you got to find the boss room. Now, if, as you, you can see, I just swapped out uh, this other weapon. This is the Firestorm Grenade. That one, you know, I don't know if it's better or not. I'm just going to go... I'm just going to go with the frostbow for now. Alright, look at that. So I found the boss room. Um, 
Yeah, let's just fight the boss. Why not? So, the boss is sometimes random. Um, but for the first level, I cannot hit this guy. The first level is it's usually some some easy guy. Um, this is Grunkar the Crusher, and he's not too tough. He's kind of slow. He can summon these uh, witches or whatever you call them. Um, I'm gonna die, aren't I? I gotta kill this guy. <laughs> oh god, I'm gonna die. Oh. Alright. It's time. Oh god. Oh god. Just kill him. Look at that. Okay. And that's how you do it, folks. That is how it's done. And we get an upgrade. So, we can increase our staff attack rate. I think we're maxed out at level 4. So we're gonna we're gonna take this one to reduce mana for for your uh, staves, or staves, however you pronounce it. Um, staff proficiency, and that is always good to have. Um, we did miss a couple of rooms back here, but for the sake of this video, I'm not gonna go on there. So you go through the go through the portal. It's gonna tell you how well you did. What bonuses you get, your points. The points don't matter, so I don't know what the point is. No pun intended. Uh, so I'll continue. When you start the next level, it's going to start in a room with uh, a weapon that you can pick up. Um, and unfortunately, this is a crap weapon, so I'm not going to take that. But I'm going to end the video here. I might make a couple more. But, um,. This is Ziggurat. I hope you'd enjoyed, and uh, we'll see you next time.